Okay. Fortnite. Hooray. Everybody loves Fortnite, right? Everybody loves Fortnite. Everybody. Everybody. So the first stage of my Fortnite experience is waiting for people to stop playing so I can join them. Because everybody's lobbies are private nowadays. Why is mine private? Who would do such a thing? Also, the cube uh, stuff's pretty interesting. It's uh, It seems to be going back to each of the relics and like doing its wooshy wooshy lightning. I don't know what it's doing next. Like The cube's so weird. So it like popped out of the sky and then it poofed all over the map and now it's under an island and now it's re it's like lightning on its poop marks. It's like what the What the heck cube? And it's like taking the island with it. And there's like corruption on the island itself, like little like cube blocks like forming like tumors on the island. It's pretty interesting. Anyway, this is what I do, like, literally. Must be someone else. And no, this is not secretly bragging about how much skins I have now. Because that doesn't really matter, because skins don't give you an advantage in the game in any way. I like lightning. I got the paddle. Paddle bass, by the way. Is that what kids are calling it? I don't know. So, oh, they're done their game. Maybe they'll invite me. Good sir. <clears throat> Wait, no. Did they start another game? Oh, that stinks. Well... I guess I'll just go on playground and this will be a cube episode. Whatever, friends are lame. I could just squat kick by myself. <coughs> okay, detective uh, staircase um, on the on the hunt for information on the cube. There's actually no one to interview, so that's interesting. Here we got our, uh, gun. Alright, let's do this. There it is. It's the uh, cube. It's all wooshy on the, on the map. It's all wooshy. So it decided to go to the pleasant one first, which is interesting, I guess. Is there some kind of lawnmower? I guess it's a lawnmower outside my house. I way preferred it when the lake was made of grape juice. And I know everyone calls it Thanos Lake, but whatever, I don't care. I much prefer... Um... Grape juice. As you can see, even from here in the caves, there's like rocks everywhere made of purple. You, unlike the actual cube, you can't shoot these and get a reaction. And they don't actually do anything, they just hang out. They're chill, whatever. Wow, this is a good drop for me. I actually went to the launch site. Uh, right, right there. Or right there, I don't remember. And it's like all broken and dusty, and there's like... Chests on the walls, and that's pretty interesting. If it was like spider webs, pretty cool. So this video is basically the lore video. I'm just going to tell you lore and stuff and jump around because I don't... I'm lonely. <laughs> Long and short of it, I'm lonely. So basically, uh, it all started pretty much when... Oh, that's great. Who built this? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... I don't exactly remember what season, but, like, this whole thing started, I th I'm pretty sure, season, um, four. Season four, yeah. 
where Omega and Carbide and all that. See, the thing is, when you think about it, Carbide and Omega and all that, that was just a red herring, because in the lore, they were literally just making a movie. It wasn't even, like, actually happening. It was a movie that they were making in the game. Because it's been, like, proven that there are actually people that live on this island that aren't us. Or maybe we do live on this island, and then every once in a while we kill each other. But, um... Because, like, pe things like construction site, like, got finished and then got cubed and all that so like the people in this world made a movie and it was Omega and Carbide all that but then there was an actual skin the if you complete like seven weeks challenge skin called the visitor who is actually in the lore see season four kicked off with the meteor coming down to make Dusty Depot Dusty Divot. And, um, when that happened, over time, the meteor in the middle, uh, started, like, getting uncovered, and there was, like, tubing and stuff in it, and then eventually you get the loading screen that was the visitor coming out of the meteor, which was actually has, like, a metal case in it. And then, uh, and then he goes, he starts at Dusty, and then he kind of just, like, makes his way, this wasn't documented at all, but he kind of just makes his way to the launch site, and he goes into space. And, uh, he sends a rocket, and it just goes up, and then it blasts through the sky and makes a giant crack called Rifts. And that's pretty much what kicked off Season 5. <clears throat> Season 5, what happened was, uh, along with the giant rift in the sky that nothing could interact with, there's also tiny rifts all over the place that sent you way up in the air. And also there's like a, uh, I don't forget what it's called, but it's a term you use when you have game stuff in real life. Because, like, their excuse was the rifts were teleporting things in the real world, and the real world was coming into the game, and it was freaking nuts and cool, and wow, go watch the Game Theory video. And then, over time, the rifts in the sky started, like, closing up, and, uh, there was one rift left, and it was kind of tiny, but it was way different because it was purple, and all the other rifts were blue plane go away trying to document stuff i'm a detective see so uh the purple rifts every like once in a while it would shoot lightning from the sky somewhere in paradise i believe like right there and then i was actually in the game when this happened i was in a playground match the like the lightning went on for a little like, normally they were like one second and they were like and then it was over but then there was a lightning that was like 10 seconds long and it went for a while and then the whole purple rift exploded and then later when you go to that place in um in paradise there was a big old purple cube you go near it and you get shield you touch it it blasts you away and if you shoot it you get lightninged and then over time and then for some reason it just popped and fatal and that's when people and it burned this and it was like there maybe and then it started moving like this way and then it ended up there and it burned a relic into the in a, a rune into the ground and what this does and it, and it creates a little dome like around it it's like an anti-gravity area where gravity is like zero pretty much you can jump super high and like if you use like any kind of item that sends you up it sends you absolutely flying even like impulses like weak little impulses they send you to the top pretty much and then it kept like every people found out that it moves every 144 minutes no, one hour, 44 minutes, and it, like, rolled over here, burned a relic, turned over here, went this way, and then, no, wait, 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 no, 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 I changed my mind, it, like, completely trashed through Tilted and went this way, 
then it made its way over here, and then it went over here, and then it went up here, and born to Relic, and now it's circled around Loot Lake, and entered through there. And then it became Grape Juice. The whole thing was purple, you couldn't go in the water anymore, and it was bouncy. If you shot it, you didn't get zapped anymore, but and you didn't get shields anymore. Then, to start off Season 6, the little cinematic showed how the purple was sucked into the middle, and then rose this island with a cube at the bottom. And then, uh, apparently, it started floating away, and it went over here, and now it's right there where I am. And, uh, it's actually on top of one of the relics right now. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I lied, because I didn't see the relic, because the thing was over it. When it was here, it didn't just turn. It went through Pleasant, went here, and then turned over to Loot Lake. So, I, I'm sorry I didn't see it. I, I lied. And that's pretty much where we are now. The island, this is like a little, like, dent in the area. Which is, like not really important. If you go in the center, it throws you out. But right here, the island is floating away, and it ended up here. And it's actually, like, on top of one of the relics right now. And it's shooting an, a, a, a metric ton of lightning onto it, and, like, super cool stuff. If you didn't see it already, we're gonna go down there and look at it. Oh yeah, if there's, like, a storm constantly around it. If you go in it, it like activates your glider mode and it sends you up. Anyway, this is what it looks like now. It's not always doing this with like the ghost demon lightning. And these craters haven't always been here that throw you away. But actually, apparently, the little area of rock where the relic actually was, it sucked that up. And now it's shooting a bunch of lightning around it, and it's dope. And now, uh, again, if you shoot the cube now, it'll damage you. But I didn't bring that. And the whole my whole screen is wobbling right now. Like, that's bananas. Open the... thank you. We don't need cl uh, clingers, but we'll, we'll keep it. So this is what the cube is doing right now. Uh, not very dis uh, descriptive. But, uh, that's what it's doing. We don't really know exactly at the moment what's happening. It's like this, which kind of just looks like purple lava. But it's the first time in a while that you could land in the middle of the storm. Of the mini storm that, this, that the cube is creating. We don't know what it's doing right now. No one does. Sure, we can have theories about it, but no one actually knows what's going on. Uh, that's uh, pretty much where we are right now. Oh, I just noticed that like there's like relics over to over the cube. There was always these mini relics that like every once in a while they would show, and if you shot it, they would show. It's pretty dope. You can still touch the cube, and it'll throw you away. It still makes the same sound effect from when it came first came to the world. That's kind of that's kind of neat. I think it's it's either impossible or extremely hard. No, it's not. It's just, like, does nothing if you get hit by the lightning. Uh, there's also these things that spawned that are out of the game right now for, like, glitch reasons called, uh, like, shadow stones. And if you, quote-unquote, consume them, then you become invisible. And you can, like, fly around. Well, you can't fly, but you go super fast. There's less gravity, and you can go through stuff, but you can't build or shoot. So it's kind of like a curse and a blessing, that kind of thing. I don't think there's any, like, coordination with these, like, little holes. I don't think they really know exactly where they want to throw. They just kind of do it. Anyway, that's, that's cube lore. That's Fortnite's lore at the moment. We don't know what it's doing or when it's going to move again. It could be. Another interesting thing I noticed is when, uh, in the lobby, the cube does that thing at the bi very bottom corner where it flashes like that. And I thought to myself, that's not what the cube is doing on the actual island. It doesn't flash like that. But now that it's doing its lightning thing, it actually flashes. That's great. That's the lightning it shoots out if you shoot it. I'm just going to get the cube to kill me and like end it there.
clangers. Pro place. Pro place, pro place. Oh yeah, I forgot you can't throw bombs on that. Never mind. What if I like stand on this? You think the lightning will like hit it? Oh, I guess not. You do not hit me, cube. Bad cube. I don't know if you're a boy or a girl. Anyway, should be like one more hit or two? Yeah, one more. Don't bully me. Oh, before I go, once you're in the cube storm, you can just fly around the circle. You can just fly around in this little area. It's pretty dope. Anyway, I'm just gonna take this thing out. And that's what it says in the kill feed when you get killed by it. You get killed by whatever that says. Alright, we're done with that match. That was, uh... I hope if anybody doesn't know what's happening with the cube, that explains it. I don't see me in the future getting in their game, so... We're just gonna end it with some live and large, you know? Bye!